to another video so today is vlogmas day three so today i'm coming to you guys with a purse collection um some of y'all after this video come probably call me a purse addict it's ridiculous really thinking about it like looking at it when i start pulling all my purses um together guys i have three clock three closet full of purses something gotta give but yeah i just have a strong love for purses the history of that is i have two grandmothers they are addicted to purses so i guess they just rubbed off on me somehow so let's get into it hey you guys so the first um bag that i'm gonna be pulling from the pile is going to be this cute victoria's secret black book bag i got this book bag i want to say my ninth or 10th grade year of high school i got this when we went on a field trip um and we stopped off at the mall and this book bag is really cute um it did great for me um with going out um you know to the like the zoo museums and all that type of stuff you know it's a, a very good um mini tote you know when you don't want to just tote like a big purse and everything and you can just easily sling it on your back i really do love this still have a strong love for this one so that was that one the next thing i'll be pulling is this cute little crossbody toe um i got this toe um from my job so and I, I had personally went and got a monogram with my initials in it and it's really cute i got this from kato's it's really cute that's that one the next one that i'm gonna be pulling um is this cute toe as well i got this from my job kato's um i want to say this past winter not this winter of course but the past winter and it was on sale i got this bag i want to say for five dollars you guys and it's great quality and it comes with another um i almost forgot it comes with another bag itself you guys like come on i'm amazing myself like i'm shocked because it's like some of these person i didn't even just remember that i had but yes really cute purse purses okay, so i'm gonna go for this one okay so i got this purse right here i want to say ross or marshall's is this cute brown aldo bag i got this in between spring and summertime and this is a really good bag you can wear this bag all season round all year round um and i love it it's very good quality it's very sturdy um like i said it goes with almost anything i wear you can wear it all year round and i want to say i got this purse for like 25 bucks at that one of those stores i can't really remember if it was ross or marshall's it's in between those two but yeah this is one of my babies so the next purse that i'm grabbing so now i have this cute little new york yankee um tote bag and i had got this i want to say earlier this year um probably in spring or summertime and i, I got this because my cousin um i don't know if her she still have her business going but she had um had or still have um a business at that time and she was selling these cute little bags and i got it for 25 and it's really cute i still um wear it to this day um basically like when i go out for brunch or dinner or something like that i want just a cute little bag or something like that so that's that then the next one i have is my cute little michael kors bag that my mom gifted to me i want to say earlier this year um she she got this so, from she got this from jc pennies and this little michael kors bag is so cute and what i love about it too um and so glad that she got it for me is that i have two michael kors belts um one that's interchangeable where i could change it from this color tone the white print to the brown print and it goes so cute together so i have this one um the next thing 
that I'm gonna be grabbing is this cute Victoria's Secret um bag and this one is a good going out type purse like concert dinner whatever like this bag is aesthetic made it is so cute and it has this cute i want to say crocodile snake skin print one of my faves and the good thing about it too it has a little mirror where you could take out so you know keep your face and your makeup beat you know so that's that one this you guys oh and it also has a fat pocket it has the cute little like scribe victoria print and say victoria's secret right here and then it also has a little piece right here say victoria's secret it's really cute okay so the next one i'm going to be showing you guys which is one of my go-to bags um and it goes with almost anything that i wear um majority of the time is this black calvin klein tote um also i could wear a crossbody if i want to most of the time i just wear it with the long scrap just on one shoulder and it's really good on storage it holds a lot it has pockets um zipper pocket it has a big back back pouch and i really love this bag i had this bag for almost probably a year now and it's one of my go-to bags so this this one and i want so um I got this one i want to say from marshall's got this from marshall's so the next bag i'm going to be showing you guys i got this at a little boutique in the town of water valley mississippi um i can't really recall the name of it people that are from water valley mississippi if you're watching you probably know the exact um boutique that i'm talking about um before you get to the amazing seafood restaurant in that town crawdads but yeah, I got this cute little um cow print purse um right before my birthday. And also she gave, well, it's a little will you spend for first time customers. And I got, I want to say 15% off. And it was very um affordable. And it's really cute. It has a lot of pockets. You got this cute tassel to it. I really love this. It's really a good bag for trail rides. For all my country girls out there so that's that hey guys so the next bag i'm going to be showing is i recently got this bag and this is one of the bags well the bag that i did get for black friday shopping is this cute simply southern um i want to say mint green bluish um color and i love it because right here it has this little latch where you have to push up and out and it has a zipper pocket and i just love the chain and the best thing about this purse i got it for eight dollars at simply southern it's very cute this bag will go cute for winter it's all depending on how you dress it up it's a good spring bag a good summer bag i just love the bag and it's a good quality for eight dollars so the next bag i'm gonna be showing you is this cute i want to say western almost chic style purse and i got it for my job at kato's and it has zipper pockets on the side beautifully studded and the inside of the bag is very spacious as well um it has how many pockets one two three pockets on this side and then on the back side of course it has a inside zipper pocket and i recently got this purse too not too long ago and it was on sale i love it that's that one and the next one i'm going to be showing you is which is a fan favorite of most and almost every female i got this cute steve madden bag i got this from one of my home girls um she was selling purses she really needs to start off selling purses again um because this went like crazy i was trying to get the um beige one but somehow i looked it up on this pretty pink and it's so cute and it came with an interchangeable um scrap um just a solid pink one but i always keep this um pretty pink steve so I just keep this pretty pink um steve madden scrap on there and come with this pretty pink pouch i also um end up putting this cute little um cali um keychain that my friend melanie had got me from when she went on her trip to um california so yeah that's this purse and it's a really cute purse i catch myself wearing this purse a good bit too as well i know it's gonna probably be one of my favorite summer purses 
love and i got that purse originally this year in the summer so the next bag that um i'm going to be showing you is this cute um corn type um i don't i don't know really what to call it but this cute little bag it's a good bag for like going to the beach cute summer bag um i could probably even pull it off knowing me how i could style it it's it's all depending on how you style stuff. So, yes, this is a really cute purse. Like, it's very spacious. And I got this from my job, too, at Kato's. Sometime this year, earlier this year. But, yeah, that's that one. Um, The next purse I'm going to be showing you guys is my Louis Vuitton purse. Uh, I want to say I had this purse for probably about a year and a half now. And I still keep it in a duster bag because, of course, I keep all my good bags and designer and name brand bags um, in good shape. Of course, because, like, if you're paying out all that money, you want to make sure your stuff is in the best form that it could be in. Like, you don't want it to just mess up or anything like that that's money wasted but it's this cute um white Louis Vuitton purse I really don't know the Pacific name for it um but in the inside of it it's red suede and yes I either put like plastic bags or some type of form of um paper mache or anything like in there to keep my my purses pumped up and it has one two three pockets in all in this purse and it came with a interchangeable scrap well a scrap that i could put on the sides of it but i usually just like to tell it like this or like this but this is my baby i'm gonna put her back over here if i could put her back in her duster bag so the next purse i'm going to be showing you guys is another purse that i got from my job at kato's i got this earlier this year so it comes with this cute little mini on keychain, which is a replica of the And I also um had this cute little um Louis Vuitton keychain on there. And you just open this part up right here. And it opens out like this. It has a good little space in it. It has two pockets on one side. And then the traditional um zipper pouch um pocket. So that's this one. Next one I'm going to be showing you guys was a gift from my dad that he had got me. It's this Italian um leather boot bag. I do not know. It's by Rioni. Uh, Rioni Folda Italia. I don't know exactly where he got it from, but it is Italian leather. And I had got this like two and a half years ago and this is a really good quality bag i love but i really love this bag you guys like it comes with this pocket on this side zipper pocket it's really spacious in that part another pocket right here also in the back you know if you don't want to just go through the house of so opening this and unzipping this i could have a leeway to just easily go in this part and just pull what's in the main part that i want to pull out um then right here it has this magnetic latch with this pocket and this is a really good bag um i want to say for anyone that's going to disney or any amusement parks or anything like that or they're gonna be just out walking and they want something close to them this is a really good bag just an all good quality bag um you can really style this bag up you could dress it down I love this bag and thanks again dad for giving me this bag i really love this bag okay so the next bag um okay so the next bag i'm gonna be showing you guys is i took it out my duster bag is my louis vuitton um duffel bag my first actual louis vuitton bag that i got myself um right here it's a cute little duffel bag um it did, it did come with a lock on there. I think I took it off of there and put onto my other Louis Vuitton purse. Um, but I love this purse. Like, this was my first. This was my first baby from Louis. 
and the inside is really cute um has that pink and stripe aesthetic got two two pockets and a zipper pocket and of course it's gonna stay Louboutin and all that so yeah I got that one. Then the next thing I got um is this cute Dooney and Burke um crossbody. And this but is my, yeah, this is my first Dooney and Burke um bag in general, and it's a cute crossbody. It's supposed to be like Tennessee State because I got this on I want to say one of my summer breaks where I went to Nashville on um, to visit my family and my cousin. She bought this for me. So yeah. I love it it's really cute it got two pockets and no other pocket just these two pockets and I love it so to my cousin Shay thank you love you love the purse so the next purse that I'm going to um be grabbing and showing you guys is this cute um I want to say coach or something similar to coach purse i don't really know um i want to say my mom grandma i really want to say my mom or my grandma got me this bag i've been having this bag for some time now and i do have a wallet that comes with this it's really cute it has a um zipper pouch on the back um a zipper pouch on the inside and let me just open it for you guys zipper pouch on the inside and a zipper pocket in there so yes i have this this is a really um go-to bag too i wear this bag a lot as well um so the next purse i got that i'm showing you guys is this bag that i got for my job again most of my purses are going to be coming from my job. Uh, I want to say I got this purse earlier this year, summertime. It's really cute. Very steady. Got that chic southern girl feel to it. Of course, because I'm from the south, you guys. So, yes, it has this cute little um pattern. um Cow print pattern around it. This mustard yellow um in the front. And it has this like brown leather um this on a strap and oh this is how this part is right here like a little tassel on a zipper part um and then this is inside and it's very spacious i love this bag so much it's very aesthetic so that's this okay and <laughs> the next bag i'm going to be showing is this bag from my job and it has this cute little tassel to it i don't really know how to describe this purse but this purse is really cute it's very it's like more on the more on the side yeah you guys i want to say that this purse is more of my um natural side um or something it's i don't really know how to describe it but it, i have a love for this purse and i just been I, I was just eyeing this purse just eyeing this purse at my job and i was like oh i want this purse but then i was like oh i don't know but then i actually came to my conscience and my senses and got it and i love it so that's that oh and also um, it's very spacious in the inside it has a zipper pocket two pockets on the other side so that's that oh Okay, so the next purse I'm going to be showing you guys is this cute um, Victoria's Secret purse that I had longer than the first one that I showed you guys, the black one. Um, as you can tell, it has a little scratch to it because I was like wearing it. But it has, yeah, a f some scratches to it because I was wearing this purse like crazy. So, yeah, this was my baby, my, my first ever Victoria's Secret purse purse in general and it has this um pocket back here zipper pocket cute little chains you know aesthetic and all that to it so that's her um scoot over next bag i'm gonna be showing you is this blank cav canvas um crossbody purse i was originally going to get this purse um monogram i'm 
more likely probably still gonna get this purse monogram and i got this for my job too it was on sale and i love the material it's very sturdy good material has this pocket um has a zipper pouch two um pouches and it, um it comes with this scrap and then also it comes with this guitar scrap to it um so yeah I, this would have really been cute for the fall time just now noticing it like with the um color scheme of the guitar scrap so yeah this would be a good purse for the fall as well um for summer so yes that's that and i also have a few other guitar scraps um that i probably be changing around with this bag but i'm more likely probably am going to go get my initials um stitched into this bag right here so the next bag i got this bag was originally not like this i got this from my job um so i personally got my initials monogrammed into it and this is a really good bag just overall with storage um i typically sometimes use this bag and have used it throughout my own um, years in college um but this bag right here is so spacious um it usually fits my tablet my notebooks binder um and other necessities but it's overall just a good bag and it's really cute i love the aesthetic of it and it comes with this cute little tassel um keychain to it so that's that the next bag i'm going to be showing you is another monogram bag this bag i want to say i got from oh i want to say marley it's a website marley and Millie. i don't know guys um i will put in description the correct name for it but i got this bag and i got it on sale and i did get it already with my initials in it um because it's it it is well it was i don't know if they still sell this as i was saying um i don't know if they still sell this specific brand of bag well style of bag on their site um but the bag did come already with my initials all i had to do was just fill out um on the lift form on the website my initials that i wanted for um the bag and it came with it. and it also came with a little key change that i cannot find for nothing you guys um it was like a brown replica keychain of this and they also sent me a cute um fountain pen with this bag so i love this site as well and they have good deals so i'm gonna make sure i put in the description i want to say marley's but to be on the safe and correct side, I'm going to put it in my description. So, the next bag I'm going to be pulling, you guys, is this cute, um, I want to say zebra print. So, it's this cute zebra print on the outside of it. And I love the scrap, you guys. So, actually, you guys, I was not planning on buying this purse at any time, um, looking at it in the store that I work at reason why i got this bag is when i had a customer come in that was an associate at another store had this bag on and it looked it's so cute and just like actually seeing her like tote it like it made it more appealing for me and i love it so it's it's snake skin print i want to say the texture of this and of course you open it you got the zero pouch and you got two pockets so yeah that purse then this next purse i got which is originally i want to say my first micro course bag and i had this bag for some years years now and my dad got me but my dad did give me this for um a christmas gift i want to say four or five years ago and i've been rocking with this bag since and i catch myself wearing this bag because like i said guys i do have micro course belts and other micro cores accessories and stuff like that and it goes well with it and so it's this cute um i want to say messenger bag and you guys the aesthetic of this bag quality of this bag is so nice like i love it and in the inside it comes with a part where i could put like my key my keys to hook on their keychains like i said i got um paper in there to protect it to keep it um you know keep it shape 
and it has a zipper pocket of course and then two um pockets in there as well and the same micro course throughout the bag and it comes with this um scrap and on the scraps um as you know um so yeah anyone that shops micro course uh, you'll probably be knowing what i'm referring to is you know um their little buckles and everything like that and lit latches it will say micro course on that as well so it says that on a few pieces of the bag <clears throat> and i just keep it right here in my um micro course duster bag to protect it and it does say micro cores on there so that's that bag and i have i want to say lastly but not lastly because i do have my um other purse but i'm currently toting that purse that is my louis vuitton tote um purse and it comes with a louis vuitton pouch but i want yeah lastly the last purse I'm going to be showing you guys is this cute um, crossbody purse that I got from my um, job, Kato's. So, at my job, Kato's, and I want to say I got this, this bag, middle of this year. And it's really cute, um, snake print. I love the shape of it. It's very spacious. Okay, for this one, it has one thin lip pocket and it's very uh, it's a short pocket and i and the thing about that pocket i want to say i use it for cards or anything like that when i do wear it and it has this zipper pouch y'all i'm getting so drained talking about these purses like <sighs> i did not know that i had this many purses like but I love all my bags. But I am going. To, I'm going to try to break the habit of buying purses. Cause seeing all of these, it could be overwhelming. But, but yeah, you guys, I'm gonna have to break the habit of buying purses so much. But it's like, else I'm gonna do it. Is it going to be a quick fix? No. <laughs> but it's like, what can you do when you're a fashion guru? Like when you're in love with fashion, you like purses, you like clothes, you like shoes. It's a habit to break. It was like, I don't hear the fashion police complaining about it. So, but yeah, you guys. So, that's all for today on um, my collection of purses. So, make sure you comment, like, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and make sure to stay lavish. Until another video, see you lavish, babes.